Marie Perry, and I'm one of the co-directors of Beauty and the Beast here at the Zigdahl Theater. It's, it's been a really great process, including the ASL and having worked with Anne before, we were able to jumpstart the process a lot sooner. And that's given us the ability to really incorporate the ASL, the ASL with everyone on stage, even more than we've been able to in previous years. Um, ASL is such a visually expressive language and musical theater is also visually, audibly expressive. So to combine all of that together creates such a beautiful, unique experience. It enhances the storytelling, enhances the choreography, it enhances the acting. Um, every aspect of the show is enhanced with the incorporation of ASL from every actor. Um, also, Beauty and the Beast, the rights companies have Hold Beauty and the Beast. So for the next foreseeable future, we don't know when this musical is going to be available to do again. So not only when you see this, it, the, this is the last year that they're allowing companies to perform this show. So it's one of your last times to see it, but it's also one of the only times you'll be able to see the whole show fully incorporating American Sign Language. So it's an incredibly unique experience for an awesome, beloved show that will obviously we love, Beauty and the Beast. <laughs>